Hi everybody, welcome back to Really Re really TV. I've got loads of new things to show you, including some Jo Malone, some new things from MAC, exciting, Creme de la Mer, Dior, which is really beautiful, and lots, lots more. So please keep watching. <laughs> So I'm going to start off with Dior, I think, really fast. Um, I've got swatches of absolutely everything on the blog, so I'm going to link to that for you. But just quickly, it's basically, I'm going to show you a few little bits that I've got here. It's about tie-dye. So here is the super beautiful blusher with all four shades, it's kind of going through the pan, you mix it together, this one gives you a gorgeous like, peachy glow, beautiful, they are, they are, it's the nude tan powder, this is the tie dye edition, two of these shades, there's a pinky one, I've got both of them swatched on the blog, absolutely gorgeous, um, new palette, there's two new palettes, this one is kind of like the more nude one, it's called Amber Nui, it's really beautiful, the other one is called Contrast Horizon, I do believe, and I've got them both swatched on the blog again. Um, there's loads of new nail shades, this is one of them here, beautiful like coral corally colour but there's also gorgeous gorgeous kind of pinky nude and a washed out yellow which is beautiful. And what else do I have here? The lipsticks quickly I'll show you because they're amazing. The tie dye um, dual addict lipstick has basically the CD symbol running all the way through the bullet so you get like a du duo tone, it does mix in together but there's two tones in the lipstick really pretty. All the shades are swatched on the blog, every single one. There's also new fluid stick shades which are beautiful on the blog for you. Right, so I'll link to that below, but that's all I'm going to talk about Dior today. Now next, MAC. There's a brand new Philip Tracy collection which is out now, I do believe, and it's blooming gorgeous. This lipstick I've got on right now is called Refined Violet and oh my god, I absolutely love it. It's just an absolutely gorgeous shade. I love it and I've worn it all week and I keep getting compliments which is always good. We like the compliments, don't we? Well, I blooming do anyway. There's that. There's another lipstick shade called Encore and that's a gorgeous, gorgeous kind of deep blood red which I love. Um, there's a few other bits. There's a really nice powder. I don't have that to show you. But what I do have is a very exciting um, fluid line colour and it's called Royal Wink. Oh, it's so beautiful. I think that would be absolutely amazing just along the lash line. Or you could use it as a eyeshadow paste all over the lid to put an, another colour on top. So, gorgeous. I'm going to get that on the blog for you as soon as I can. Oh, the Trend Forecast palette. This is really exciting. They never have samples of this, so I couldn't believe it when I got this. So basically, each season, MAC create a palette that uses all the key shades of the season, basically. So this is the trend forecast for Fall 15 lip. Ermine, Sweet Salmon, Smoke Petal, Grand Canyon, She Devil and Royal Ritual. I mean, that shimmery purple is incredible. So very excited about that. I'm going to get swatches on the blog for you very soon. Mia Moretti, that's out now. Uh, Mia Moretti is like a cool DJ girl who I've never heard of before because I'm not cool. I'm going to get all the information because you know when, with MAC they, they get the samples really early and the shades change. But this is a cream colour base. Really nice creamy, sandy, goldy, champagne-y colour base. Here's Mia. She's a bit cool. It's called Summer Wind, that one. Pale Sand Shimmer gorgeous and the other there's, there's a quite a lot in this collection which I'll talk about in the blog post but the bits I've got I will show you now this is a oh a casual color I love the, I love MAC casual colors they're amazing I love the ones in the red 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 collection which I've got a blog post on if you want to find it on reallyre.com but this is called putting on the spritz beautiful kind of corally orangey pinky uh, casual colour and they have lips and cheeks so love those and then I've also got I mean there's loads of really gorgeous stuff they actually have Mia Moretti makeup bags as well which are pretty stunning but this is a gorgeous gorgeous lipstick and it's called oh it's called Mia Moretti how exciting cherry red in amplified and it just looks like the most beautiful piece of frozen gel of beautiful amazing colour um, I'm going to get that on the blog for you because I just think that's going to be a real winner 
So yeah, make sure you check out reallyme.com for updates on those. Yes, and finally from MAC, I'm really excited about this, so I'm gonna try it very soon. It's out in June, Mineralize Time Check. Basically, Time Check is a um, priming fluid to put on before your um, foundation. Basically evens everything out, clears, uh, kind of covers pores, blurs lines and wrinkles. I haven't tried it yet, but I've heard amazing things, so that will be on the vlog very soon. Stay tuned. Okay, creme de la mer, really quickly. I'm so excited about this. I really am. It's an SPF 30. It's called creme de la mer, the reparative skin tint SPF 30. And it's basically, well, they're saying more than a BB, light years away from a CC, so it's kind of like futuristic uh, skin base, basically. It's SPF 30, as I've already said, which I love because I am absolutely anti-sun. I can't put it any more clearly than that. I'm just scared of it. I just want to keep my skin away from the sun. So SPF 30 is great for me. It gives you a lovely dewy, glowy base, which I really like. I've actually got it on now. I don't know if you can see that nicely or not. Um, it's got the Miracle Broth that's in Creme de la Mer uh, cream. It's got all the anti-aging stuff like algae that kind of re regenerates your skin, uh, clears any dullness and renews for brighter skin and all that good stuff. I've got a blog post about this with all the shades that are going to be available in the UK, I think. Maybe not maybe not very the fa fairest one I don't have, but I'm using Light, which is this one, which I've got before and after photos on the blog. So make sure you check that out. It's £65 and it's out now at Selfridges. I've seen it online already. Jo Malone, I've given you quite a lot of um, updates on Jo Malone recently, um, so it's come quite up to date right up until June, I think, so make sure you check out the blog for that. Um, but the newest thing I want to talk to you about is the charity candle. Do you know that um, Jo Malone set up these charity gardens, which is basically about improving people's lives, giving them jobs as gardeners? The newest one that is launching is Castle Park Physic Garden in Bristol, which looks like this it's really gorgeous and the new candle which they all exactly 100 percent of the uh cost of the candle is is donated to this uh the garden fund basically and this shade is called white lilac and rhubarb oh my god it's gorgeous oh it really is that is like oh you need it it's one of the freshest lightest prettiest gorgeous nothing too sweet um i love rhubarb anyway and clearly i'm loving white lilac too and the candle is absolutely so pretty i always love their charity candles i think my favorite one was not last year the year before was like a greeny color uh, really beautiful um comes with its little top 42 pounds and i'm gonna let you know when it's available butter london really nice from butter london lovely lovely new lip crayons um they i really they're so nice they feel great they last a really long time um i've got all oh, i've got four five of the shades four of the shades on the blog so i'll link to that below but they're called lippy bloody brilliant lip crayon and uh basically you get a nice slim pencil so you can line your lips and fill in they give a really nice intense color and shine um lovely cool thing about this it's got lid but in the lid is a sharpener so you're always going to have your sharpener with you to keep that nice and crisp so that you know if you're lining you're going to be happy with that so i've got all the shades not all the shades um, i will link to the blog post below model zone they've gone all festival crazy so we're looking at cool nail colors face paints in yellow and gold and more there's lip colors um neon violet hair uh, coloured hairspray and that one is neon blue exciting so if you're a festival type of girl then model zones your place because that looks really fun i'm not a festival kind of girl oh, sorry i just hate them it's the whole toilet thing i can't bear but um i do like this fun collection see so i've got some lovely new lip glosses it's called custom kiss which is uh it's kind of peachy but clear and it adapts to your own skin tone so I'm going to pop that on and see what happens then there's oh yeah really nice uh, liquid chrome metallic eyeliner which looks really exciting oops oh yeah that looks pretty cool it probably works quite well see that what else 
triple shot mascara for this mascara. This is also a glow pop cream bronzer. I'm excited to look at that. Let me just, let me get that out. Because <laughs> I like that kind of thing. Ooh, yeah. That's pretty cool. Look. I like that a lot. So I you can use that straight from the uh, ball, I think, and blend it out. It's quite a nice neutral colour as well, so that'll be good. Um, and a blush pop as well. Shadow sticks. How do these work? Are they crayons? Oh yeah. Now I've seen this kind of thing before. You know when it like has like this shadow, like a powder on the end, and you can use that and then blend out. They look really good. So I'm going to get those up on the blog as soon as I can. Nude sticks have some new things that, in at Space NK. I really like nude sticks. Basically, the whole range is sticks. They come in this really cute little packaging. It's like a matte tin. Inside you get mirror. Ooh, flashy lights. And this new addition is the, like new kind of like correction pencil. This is a clean up pencil which you can use if you dab your mascara on your lid and it's like uh, all over it, can't get rid of it. Ruining your whole makeup if you try and like get a wipe on it or whatever. But this is supposed to just get rid of it. I haven't tried it yet, but I really want to. Exciting. They all come with a little sharpener too, which is nice. And the other one I've got, matte and blemish pencil. So you can kind of use this to mattify and cover Oh, and also has like anti-blemish uh, in it, so it doesn't cover, but it, it just mattifies and kind of uh, works on spots, so that's cool, same kind of packaging, lovely, they're, I think they're out now, they're new. Dr. Hauschka's got a new night serum, I really like Dr. Hauschka skincare because it's just so natural and gentle and really effective. Um, so that's an overnight um, serum. It supports the skin's essential processes, hydrating formulation featuring apple fruit, hydrosol, and apple blossom extract to tone and refresh and benefit all skin conditions. So yeah, I'm, I'm excited to try that. Diego Della Palma have got loads of new nail polishes in some really, really gorgeous shades. So they're really nice. Um, out from April, 9.50 each in Mark Spencer's. A few more shades here. Oh, beautiful nude. Oh, lovely kind of fuchsia gorgeous shade. Love that. Um, yeah, so there's quite a few shades. I'll try and get them on the blog as soon as I can. A few little bits from Urban Decay to show you. These are the um, high Revolution High Colour Lip Gloss. So really, really nice packaging. Intense uh, colour. There's a lot of glosses coming back at the moment. Oh, wow made a mess there um ooh, yeah that's pretty gorgeous what shade is that number 69 righty ho and this one's called scandal so that is really they really are just calling that 69 oh lovely beautiful pink oh, i love that color and the scandal is here let's give you a little swatch of that you see so i'm loving my pink lipstick at the moment really a lot crazily I didn't for a while but I do now and the other thing we've got from Urban Decay a new uh, eyeshadows so that one's called Backfire oh Backfire is a current shade isn't it must be maybe it's one of the um, pencils yeah Fireball and Backfire can't get them out though which is bloody annoying oh, beautiful so there's Fireball oh they're all like duochrome I love those. Oh yeah, lovely, beautiful, purpley shade. Yeah, they're, they're really nice reflective colours, lovely. Also, L'Oreal Paris have got a nude palette out now. I think it was out last month actually, but I just haven't had samples. So uh, yeah, that's pretty exciting. Let's have a look at that. Oh yeah, kind of looks quite a bit like the YSL Couture palette, the nude one. So that's pretty exciting. Um, I'm going to try and get that on the blog for you soon. $14.99, that's not bad. So that's out now. You can find that boots, I'd imagine. And then finally, before I wrap everything up, Kiko has got some fun new stuff. Free Spirit Lips and Cheeks. What's this? Oh, look. So really nice lip and cheek pen there. That looks beautiful. What a gorgeous shade. You see that? Just that one there. Next to all the other drawings. Oh, I love that. Wowza. Yeah, and they come with a sharp, big sharpener for their jumbo. They've got a new mascara. There's loads in here. I won't show you all of it, so I'll get it on the blog soon. That's another 
Oh, lip and cheek. Quite a few of those shades. Um, oh, Kajal. I'll show you the Kajal eyeliner. This looks fun. What have we got in here? Mysterious Earth 02. Wow. Oh, gosh. Look at that. It's like a wooden box. And, oh, yay. Look at that. It's like a blushy bronzer. Baked blush. In nice earthy tones with, look, mirror in there, which is exciting. Um, oh, and it's magnetic. Look. Here's a liner. Oh yeah, nice. Very nice kind of bluey colour there, if you can see. That's that one there. I'm covered in these colours though. So they're really nice. Let me just see when it's out. This Pico collection, it's called Modern Tribes. I did know that. Yeah, so that's all that. It looks all nice and bronzy with some accent, colour accents, which look beautiful. Launching April. Pico, such a brilliant, affordable makeup brand. And I come up with anything I don't like from that from the range so yes that's pretty cool so for any Willis fans out there here's the little Bubba Lulu's he's so cute yes he is I love him so much hopefully he's going to be able to go outside soon but you need to hurry up and grow a bit more don't you Willie yeah say hello Willis say hello oh not that your privates out have you Here's a look. Oh, Willis, you're so beautiful. So, thanks for watching. Hi from Willis. Bye from me. And I'll see you next time. Don't forget to check out the blog for any information that you want. Reallyre.com. And you can chat to me on Twitter, at reallyre. And I shall see you next time. Bye now.